feels like winter, I'm not going to lie. It's been so cold. It's definitely wise to have those emergency kits in your car. Yeah, and I feel like we're kind of used to winter already, uh, which is so odd. Yeah, I shouldn't be acclimating already. No, and guess what? We have more snow on the way. <laughs> we're all kind of rolling our eyes like, come on, it's the beginning of November. All right, as far as today, a uh, cool front rolling its way on through. Now we're going to have a battle of some sunshine and the cooler air filtering its way on. And basically, it will be colder than yesterday. And then the next system I'm watching, this clipper, going to move on in overnight into tomorrow morning. That's when we're going to see the snow. Uh, right now, though, currently in Green Bay, it's 33 degrees. The winds have been picking up. Uh, they're going to be changing, and they're changing right now with that front rolling its way on through. Have seen a couple little snow showers and flurries as the front passes. It actually was accumulating on a little bit of the pavement here early this morning. That front comes on through. Sun's going to come back today, but it's going to be blustery and cold. Uh, tonight, anything you have to do in the evening, it's going to be fine. But overnight, here comes the snow. And do you notice how by tomorrow morning, the farther you are to the south, the steadier the snow will be falling. But to the north, not as much falling like towards Crivets, Anigo. Uh, this continues through the morning, kind of moves out of here as we head through tomorrow afternoon. That's what I'm thinking right now. Around Green Bay, uh, Highway 29 south of there, one to three inches with the higher totals, the farther you head towards like Fond du Lac and Sheboygan, Green Lake and Marquette. Only a trace up to an inch to the north. So the farther you live north, the lesser the amounts of snow. Because of all of this, our first winter weather advisories have been issued for our southern counties. That goes into effect at midnight until noon on Wednesday. That's where most of the snow is going to fall. Lesser amounts again, farther north. 48, the average high in yesterday actually turned out to be decent, 46. But now we have that cooler air behind the front. There's Fargo, 35. Uh, currently, 31 Oshkosh and Fond du Lac. Temperatures right around that freezing mark with wind chills that feel like the 20s. It feels like 9 in Anago. So here comes that cold front. All right, Skycast again, sun coming back today. That snow is going to get here for many of us overnight into tomorrow morning's commute. So as far as today, 35, cold and breezy, becoming mostly sunny. Winds have been picking up. That snow develops overnight tonight into tomorrow morning's commute. And because of these chilly temperatures, it looks like it's going to be sticking. And of course, that salt going to try to help that situation. And again, that tapering off into Wednesday afternoon. Thursday and Friday, not even making it to freezing. Could have another shoveler going into Saturday night, maybe Sunday morning. Look at next Monday. Oh, my goodness. Uh, 26, are you kidding me? That's too cold. I know, so we've got a really cold week coming up. 